ever mascot, Clark the Bear. Hmm. Described as a young, friendly cub who can't wait to interact with the kids. Also worth noting, oh my he doesn't goodness. wear any pants. Uh, <laughs> I think that is a gag photo. If we can switch to the next one, he also chooses to... Oh, my God. Well, yeah, yeah, I'm about to play you this clip from Comcast, uh, Comcast Business Network. I, think, I believe it's in I believe it's in Chicago, perhaps, and they were debuting a new mascot for the Chicago Cubs. And out comes I don't know if this reminds me of Disney, the way that Disney actually just really just did this shit in some of the movies, or this reminds me of Fight Club. Remember Fight Club, where like the um, where um, Tyler Durden was cutting single frames and stuff into the movies. Matter of fact, if you actually watch the end of Fight Club, the very last frame they flash uh, they flash a dick at you. Anyway, speaking of flashing the dick at you. Let's check out this clip. Now we turn to mascots. The Chicago Cubs, they introduced their new mascot, their first ever mascot, Clark the Bear. Hmm. Described as a young, friendly cub who can't wait to interact with the kids. Also worth noting, oh my he doesn't goodness. wear any pants. Uh, <laughs> I think that is a gag photo. If we can switch to the next one, he also chooses to wear sneakers. But the new Pelicans, they may have a mascot problem of their own. Their mascot, Pierre the Pelican, is horrifying. He looks like a deranged, bloodthirsty clown that feeds on children. So both of them pretty bad, but which one was... Oh, yo. All right. I want to just take it from the top. Yo, for real, do you notice the way... Yo, I'm, I, I lined it up, the, um, the clip, so that little, for a, little, a little preview part. I mean, I kind of did it in a weird order. You know what I mean? Now that I'm looking at the thing from, from the whole time, do you saw the part when she said interact and kid friendly? Yo, it's almost like the words, first of all, called kid friendly. Kid friendly, all right. Well, most mascots are supposed to be, you know what I mean? Almost every, what, what cartoon character with no pants on actually has, you know, genitalia showing? What you gonna call it? All right, and I got a dog that licks herself, so please don't even get me started. But anyway. She right, right, right when she says interact, that's pretty much the cue word to flash a goddamn dick at everybody. And it's funny because that shit, first of all, what, how, you know how sports fans can be. You know what I mean? They can be really fucking anal and obsessive over this shit. And I can imagine a Cubs fan being really, really so pissed off that they fucking around and pulled some evil prank on people like this. You know, because it's like, this shit is either like some old Fight Club shit or some Disney shit. You know what I mean? It kind of reminds me of the Little Mermaid with all the penises on the cover. The um, when when Ariel, when um, Ariel and Prince Eric get married, then the, the pastor gets an erection. Like the rescuers down under when they showed the um, the um, the, the topless nude thing in the window real quick. You know what I mean? Real um, subliminal craziness. And the whole thing is that yeah, like wait, like first of all, yeah, that wasn't an accident. You know what I mean? I was I was just I was just somebody just straight up showing you know what I mean like where the hell did they even get that what where, where did they even get a picture and put it who somebody had to have gotten fired or some shit like that it reminds me of um who was it drive me crazy with the dude from uh, from, from Entourage or like I think I think one of his friends pulled in the AV department pulled some prank on on the, on the school or news network I'm in mean, with the in crowd and other people all types of crazy shit anyway um let me wrap this up I ain't gonna go too far well um. Only thing weird was the fact that the reporters kind of like um I don't know when they cut back to you guys say that the b- b- black guy was kind of laughing, you know what I mean? The lady was talking, so I guess she had to stay in professional mode. She really maintained her composure, but like of a yeah. But the only thing is that composure, my ass. Why the hell they even put that up there? That shit was so perverted, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't know, maybe they issue an apology or something like that. You know, I was saying about that with that news reporter who was talking about, you know, having sex with having sex with the missing woman. I'm like, he should have at least been able to apologize for saying that before they fired his ass. Whoever got fired needs to apologize. Oh, Comcast needs to issue an apology. You know what the funny thing is? Comcast and that. Never mind. Let's just say I got an account on X videos. Uh, never mind. Um. That's about it. I just wanted to give you that, give you that real quick. That shit was hilarious. A fucking dick on the cable network. You know what I mean? Um, I'm trying to think what, what else has been that bad? But that's about it. That's almost. That's like, I don't know, man. That's like sending out. That's like that's bringing near worse than Anthony Weiner or some shit to me. You know what I mean? Anyhow, yeah, that was some pedophile shit. Um, I right, hope y'all enjoyed that.
I'm gonna get a show.